Welcome back to Let's Play Control. I'm Burning Dog Face. This is nowhere near where I need to be. But before I jump cut off to there, I wanted to uh, do a shout out to Derek Floyd, who had a comment on these freaky guns. Well, let's see here. Uh, the gun the security card carries is another Franken gun. This one has the receiver of an FN Mag 58 general purpose machine gun, oh, with a hilariously stubby shoulder stock, mated to the pan magazine and shrouded barrel of a Lewis gun. It probably uses the 7.62 times 51 millimeters NATO round, since the Mag uses it, and the Lewis guns made in America were chambered for the slightly longer. Uh, 30-6 Springfield, a.k.a. 7.62 times 63 millimeters. Huh. It's almost certainly not here supposed to say that part, but, you know, I'm not a gun guy. Uh, oh, also mentions in this same comment, uh, separately, that I was on the money about Ati's weirdness, some of it, I should say, being because he was, uh, saying Swedish idioms, uh, literally translated into English. Is that that is a coffee machine? Why is why is that's not a coffee machine at all? Oh, huh. I thought only Rage ever tried doing that, where it loads in the uh, the worst textures when you're not looking directly at something. Looks like it uh, saw through me that time. What's that tire made of? It shouldn't be clicking against the ground. Did I actually look in there? I don't know if I opened that door. Oh, before I head off. I guess I didn't! are these things, anyway? I get that they have upgrades in them, but, like, in-universe, what are these? I had my fingers on the wrong keys. I'm just gonna go ahead and put that down. And, uh, then I'm going to close the door so no one notices the mess I made. Although, on a side note, uh, really brave of those guys not to just lock themselves up in there where the Explodey Man can't get them. Uh... Right. Oh, that's right! I just got back here from the coolant pumps area, so I, instead of, uh... Okay. I guess I will try to get closer to there. Whoosh! <laughs> the fuck happened over there? This doesn't go anywhere, this is just a dead end. Oh, hey. Sup? Oh man, things are really bad down here, huh? Well, look at the bright side. At least the TV isn't showing Threshold Kids. Oh! I had a comment about that. Uh, yes, shout out to Elthwar, who informed me that in real life, the United States uh, has two newspapers specifically for military personnel. Uh, Army Times and Stars and Stripes. So, uh, an internal newspaper dedicated entirely to the Bureau is, uh, not, you know, that far out of the realm of possibility. Especially given that, uh, it's not like they can find out news in their, you know, the, the, the world of Bureau stuff by, uh, just turning on the TV. As I walked into this room, the whole building shook, and uh, Jesse just muttered, Just hold on a little longer. And then I noticed this happening in the next room, so this felt, you know, relevant. Okay. Power up! Do 
guys couldn't hit the broad side of a fucking barn. Oh, hell. Oh, what did you guys get behind me? What the hell? Ah, oh, I'm dying. Okay. Damn it! I kept- I keep accidentally hitting E today. It's like, mm, I was just trying to- I was trying to hit R so I could shoot around the corner. You know, by switching the camera to my other shoulder. But no, I just pulled a chunk out of the ground and then threw it into the wall trying to get rid of it. Well, you know, they shot me to death. Fuck! You're supposed to finish loading the bar. God damn it! Uh, and I'm in the same damn place. Okay, fine. Get out of my way. Okay, can't get over there. These artifacts can do many things. They can't get me over there, because I am not Spider-Man. <sighs> I don't know how my sense of direction is this bad. Like, really. Fortunately, once I found the place, it's just right over here. That's better. That could have been very bad for me. The fuck? Well, uh, these are interesting things. But I don't need to be in there. So I'm just gonna wait to see if monsters come out. Excellent. More arcs of the covenant. Wow. Wait, is that the actual door? Yes, it is. A hey, you guys got to hear it this time. No mercy for monsters! That's not cover, that's a projectile. Look at that, a skid is trying to help me. Oh, God. Zigzag! Fuck. Thank you, Jeremy. There's someone around here, uh... is proving to be 100% competent. What are you, man? You are not welcome here. Ritual in intuition achievement progress, one out of ten. I don't think that's how. Oh. Yeah, it's not going there. I think it's pattery. This is pattery with me. Up. You need to fix it before the old trick pants get a shit Good. 
God. What did they do to you? The, the the texture of his skin, it reminded me of the fucking working Joes from uh, Alien Isolation. That's not a compliment, if you haven't played that game. Working Joes are androids designed for people who are uncomfortable around uh, androids. Because, so they are uh, intentionally designed to be obviously not human. They have rubber skin and glowing lights for eyes. Have a seat. Oh boy, that was a big sound. I didn't like that sound one little bit. Don't quit your day job! Sorry, do you not like it when I do that? Well, I don't like it when you turn human beings into puppets! So I guess neither of us are happy about this situation. somebody's son. That one, too. You assholes go around turning them into mindless things to kill people with. Oh, for fuck's sake, if you're going to be a coward about it, you get you out of both of our miseries. Hold still. I need to kill this guy with a head. Oh, not an executive. Fuck! Oh, hey. Up yours. Ooh, 30,000 out of 100,000 Paranatural Collection. That's a bazooka! And it curved around a corner! Just dump all those bullets at him at once. Excellent power generation. You know, as opposed to the, uh, JS-300, which provides shitty power. None of this artisanal stuff. No, that's new. What do you do? Ah, you're the energy converter. Okay, this giant tube thing. Honestly, I have no idea what that means, energy converter, so... Really glad I stumbled into that. We are very far underground, but there's sunlight coming in. I don't know what to make of that. Jeremy, I'll let you field this one. That motherfucker with the shield go. There you are! Both of those guys at that throw. That was awesome. What the fuck? They seem to really want me to use this spin power. I'll just take that out of there so it stops defying the laws of physics. You're welcome. I don't actually care, mind you, but the laws of physics get really, really pissy when people ignore them, so, you know, I just don't want to make a headache for us later down the road. Oh, that was satisfying. A fucking pinata. Full of nightmare smoke. Oh hell yeah, you convert that energy. Oh, that reminds me, I've got a really, really horrible thought in my head that I can't shake. And I don't like that, because in this game, the most horrible thoughts will probably turn out to be true. 
It's about... I went back and rewatched the hotline thing for, uh... What was it actually called? Yeah, just the one about Northmore. You know, the, the guy who was director before him. Before Trench, I should say. And, uh... Oh. Okay. I kinda didn't think that would work, but okay! Do I have ammo efficiency minus 5%? I could find something better than that. Headshot damage. Energy regained from headshots. Hmm. Almost double damage. Oh, sorry, almost to damage and a half, and I'm uh, low on health. But what defines low? Maybe that's when the jam appears on the screen. Fortunately, my accuracy is terrible, so I don't know if this is a good one. What is this one? Ammo cost per shot. Oh, uh, shit. I guess I'll try this one for a while. What's this? Oh, yeah, that's actually pretty good. Wait, what? Another shatter one. Recoil minus 6%. That's not really the problem I have with shatter. It doesn't fire fast enough for the recoil to really be a problem. This door has no hinges. It's just there. Oh no, no, they're on this side. My mistake. I thought it was just floating there, and there was actually no way to open it. It's like the concept of a fence that you can't get into. How long have you been right there? Better. Ooh. All right, I improvised my way out of that problem. Where the fuck am I going to find the last one? Uh. Oh, duh! When I opened that one, it, it opened this door. So there must be another door. No. Uh. What am I missing then? Didn't open that door. Did this go anywhere on this side? No. 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 I can't see anything in the sunlight. Ah! I'm gonna pretend I did that on purpose, because, uh... I just walk it off. I haven't found any lore in a while. There's one there. Oh, it's all the same... Mm, I am a fool. I didn't notice that. It's all the same pile. So where's the last one? There's only two things on this one. Up there, maybe? How the fuck do I get up there? Have I even been on this side of the room? What's going on here? That's right, kids. It protects you from military invasions and sexually transmitted diseases. I suppose it wouldn't be protecting kids from that. Ideally. But, uh... Protected someone from that. <laughs> All you gotta do is stay in the booth and never come out. See, it works perfectly. <laughs> yeah, that was one of those sentences I said and then thought about the meaning of afterwards. Why is this open? Is Robocop clearing his prime directives again? Oh, fuck! Wait, 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 wait. Didn't I. I thought I put one on the bottom part. Maybe I'm just losing it. I mean, it would be appropriate here. Let's go lift the lockdown. Hell yeah! Honestly, I think it's probably a really bad idea giving the Hiss access to more of the facility. But, you know, what the hell. I mean, they are right about the fact that we can't really do much ourselves like this. So, let's get creative. I guess I just backtracked my way out of here, huh? Must 
map doesn't line up at all. There's no path here. Unless it's beneath me? No, it's in a wall. Okay. Oh, fuck! That's how I get out of here. And this is just locked. Where's that elevator that go? No, it's a walkway above? I just took a wrong turn. Again. There is a walkway up there. Okay, that must be how I get to the elevator. And since I found no way to get up there, I'll just keep going. I guess all she's doing is spinning the gun in her hands, but Jeremy knows what she wants it to do. Oh! Uh, I had one other thing I wanted to mention that I thought was very amusing. Uh, here it is. Uh, shout out to the... Uh commenter who said, I think it's awesome that you named the service weapon Jeremy. So yes, thank you very much to Jeremy Nixon Patton. <laughs> uh, why do I sense an ulterior motive? <laughs> oh, but there is the timer. So let's just look over here and read this lore and see what we get. Upcoming game reminder. Next game is Wednesday at 8. Usual spot. Hazard. Owes me $20. Uh, Arish. Still in a fucking winning streak. Because someone, please figure out how he's cheating. Thompson. Suspended for a game because of that shady dealing incident. Guy. I owe you $60. Or I owe him, I guess. I brought beers last time, so it's Hepstonstall's turn. Remus. Uh, I'm trying to think here. Poker is way too obvious for uh, the Federal Bureau of Control, even in their off hours. So maybe they're betting money on games of Uno or something. I don't know. Arish always has a uh, reversal hidden in his sleeve. I'm sure no one will notice if I just take this. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, that'll about do it. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you next time. Oh. On Let's Play Control. Oh, there's a control point over there, so I guess that's what we'll be doing next time. <laughs> see you then, Burning Dog fans. Later.